a historic peace effort. Uh, the president, like with all things, uh, urged us to take an untraditional approach. Uh, you can't solve problems that have gone unsolved by doing it the same way that people before you have tried and failed. Uh, the president takes untraditional approaches. He does things in different ways, uh, but he uses common sense and he tries to unite people by focusing on common interests as opposed to allowing them to focus on their common grievances. And what happened was here is we were able to achieve results that others were not able to achieve, and this will advance the region, and this will advance the whole world. Uh, I would like to say to the people of the region, uh, Muslims, Jews, Christians, that this does give hope that the problems of the past do not condemn you to a future with conflict. Uh, there is a lot of hope and a lot of potential, and this will benefit you, and this will also benefit people here in America, because in America, we, we used to have a big dependency on the Middle East for uh, gas and for oil, thanks to your leadership. America is now energy independent. We no longer have that, but a lot of American soldiers have uh, fought uh, for uh, securing our allies in that region and um, making more peace there. Lessons are need as a country to have as many soldiers in that region and lessons are need to have as many conflicts in that region. And obviously radical extremism, which uh, we see as a cancer that has infected so many areas in the world.